everybody. So today we're gonna take the GTR apart. Let's get to work. First, we're gonna take off the fender. In order to do that, we need to take off the rubber cover. It has a bunch of 10 millimeter screws. And then on the front and on the back, it has a clip like that. And the one on the back. And then it has clips. All you have to do is just pull it. Just be careful. You see like that? It clips into there. It has the same type of clips all the way across. So you just be careful so you don't rip the tabs. Pretty easy. You got it. two tabs on the fender. And then you just slide it out. Now we'll take off the fender. So what we'll do is turn the wheel and unscrew all the screws that are holding the fender liner to the fender. Now we unscrew the bolts. We got two on the inside when you open the door. Then we open the hood. So under the hood, this plastic thing is in the way. We have to take that off first to get to the bolts. The fender is pulled down right here with the phone. And that's it, the fender is off. This is the foam that I was talking about. Let's go down all the way. Now we take up the support. So, I thought I was recording yesterday when I was pulling this support off, but apparently I wasn't. So we got it off, it was a lot of fun. What I had to do is uh, disconnect the power steering line, it's right here, this line. 
connects over here. I got it all blocked off. Disconnect that one, the low pressure. Then the high pressure one is right here. Got it blocked off with some old hose. Disconnect that to the wiring harness that connects to that. What they did was build the fan into the support. So you have to take it all apart and put it all back together like a puzzle here. And then you have to undo this intake pipe to get to around these AC lines. Yeah, you have to uh, evacuate the AC system to do this too because all the lines go through the support. Then they got these brackets bolted up here to remove those to slide it off. And don't forget to prop your hood up with something else because the hood prop is right there. Yeah, that was pretty much fun. But we got it. We're about to start. Assembling the new support, which we have right over right here. That was a pain in the ass. I gotta put this pipe and these through the same time. Now we on the right. Now we need to get the mirror off. And here's the bolts for the mirror. Now we're going to take out the trim that goes around the handle.
has a screw right there. You can unscrew it here or go inside and unplug it and pull it out. We'll just unscrew the screw and take off the trim.